Hey guys, Mr. Rand here. I just wanted to hop on and read a book for you guys. If you're bored or you need something to do or maybe you just need a little extra reading um, and wanna check this out, this is the perfect time to do so. So I got this book in the mail today. It's called The Box Turtle. It's really adorable. So I would love to share it with you guys. Also, if you're watching this, thank you so much. And just know that all the teachers we really, really miss you guys, and we hope that you guys are having a good break. And so, yeah, thank you for logging on and reading this story with me. This is The Box Turtle by Vanessa Rader. So we'll go ahead and jump in. The Box Turtle by Vanessa Rader. When the little box turtle hatched, his parents noticed something missing, but they weren't dismayed. They gave him a name and a shell, both of which fit just right. Now remember, Terrence, you are so much more than just a shell. Terrence's shell kept him dry on the soggiest days, safe from the snoopiest strangers, and on the scariest nights. It was big enough to share. Terrence loved his shell. Until one day, your shell is weird. Suddenly, Terrence's shell seemed too boring, too bizarre, and too big for the little box turtle to bear. So he abandoned it to search for something better. Terrence searched high and low until his new shell looked sleek. But it showed too much cheek. The search continued. He looked classy, he looked sassy. He looked just like Grandma Mildred. He looked for another shell. He found it, a perfect polka dotty package. Oh yeah. That was positively petrifying. Terrence tried shell after shell, after shell, after shell, but nothing fit. This whole situation stunk a lot. That's it, I give up. Here you go. In that moment, the hermit crab showed what it meant to be a friend. The little crustacean was so much more than just a shell. And maybe Terrence was too. Terrence knew what he needed. But when he found his old shell, oh no, it had changed. It's okay, we can fix it. Terrence patched on soggy days. He toiled on chilly nights. The task grew big enough to share. Finally, the shell was finished. It wasn't sleek or sassy. It was far from perfect and definitely weird. But Terrence wasn't dismayed because this little box turtle was so much more than just his shell. The end. If you stuck around for that story, thank you so much. Comment below or like the video so I know that you're here. And just remember, all the teachers seriously miss you guys. I hope you guys are being safe. And continue to check back on if there's any other videos that are uploaded. Have a great night. And again, thanks for watching. Bye, guys.